Hey, what's up, everybody? This is your boy Montre, and I'm at work right now, so I'm definitely on a different work schedule. I want to say happy Saturday to everybody. What's up? How you doing? Today, I want to talk about HIV and a cure to HIV, so let's talk about it. Now, I realize that uh, HIV is something uh, that affects not only the gay community, but uh, people who are not gay. Um, it affects a lot of people. A lot of people have HIV. People in Africa have HIV. Uh, so many people are, are, are infected by the virus. Now, I see so much stuff online about a cure, a cure to this, a cure to that. People are constantly giving money for a cure, but honestly, and this is just my only opinion, my only two cents, I really don't ever believe that there's ever going to be a cure to HIV. This is my two cents. And I'm going to tell you why. Because HIV is a virus. It's a retrovirus. And I, and I know retroviruses may act differently from viruses, but it's a virus nonetheless. It's a virus infection. There are two other things that I can think of that are virus infections that we still don't have cures for. And that is the flu, which is a viral infection, and herpes is also a viral infection. We don't have cures for these, so how can we expect to have a cure for HIV? There is no cure for a viral infection. When you get a viral infection, you just have it, and they give you stuff to either suppress it or put it to sleep, basically. Suppress or put it to sleep. But you, when you have a viral infection, you just have it, which is the case with HIV. Right? I think in the future, we will probably have a vaccine to suppress it so that people won't have to take uh, daily meds for it. But I doubt if we ever will see a cure. So when people say, oh, there's going to be a cure, I don't think so. I, now, I will retract one thing is that I saw an article where they were talking about doing some DNA manipulation to the human body to actually cancel out the virus, which would mean that's like a semi-cure. But anytime, because they can't test that on animals, they would have to test that on humans. And I think that fucking with people's DNA is a really, really kind of scary thing because yeah I don't know if y'all seen that movie Resident Evil and they started messing with people's DNA to fight the T virus and then everybody turned to zombies yeah okay give me a two cents on what you think about that because if you don't do it then who will